What's going on guys? Uh, heading to the gym right now. Uh, just been editing all day, getting things figured out with the channel. I haven't worked out for a while and definitely need to uh, get back on that. Need to make sure that they are taking my uh, my cash out on the 6th instead of the 5th because I get paid the 5th. And uh, basically the money that I, like the checks I get from work is just my play money like uh, going out to, I don't want to say going out to eat because it's not really going out. Like I, uh, I go to Chipotle and that's like going out, it's like a fancy meal for me because I love Chipotle. It's my favorite thing ever. But uh, I'm going to head to the gym, release some stress, and then back into work at 9 tonight. I really wish I could have got that time lapse last night because that would have been awesome. But, I mean, like I said yesterday, it's just the two seconds it would have taken to do it, it would have put me behind. Or I, at least I felt that way. Like, looking back, obviously, that wasn't the case. But, uh, I don't know. I just didn't want to didn't want to have a manager walk up. I'm supposed to be, like, proving myself bartending. And uh, just got really, like, distracted, you know. But... Yeah, I was hoping to have a chill day, man. It's, uh, it's been a while since I had time to relax. Uh, I'm going to be heading back home to Indiana here pretty soon. One of my good friends is getting married. I'm bringing the GoPro with me the whole time and everything, of course. Uh, show you guys around my hometown. I already have some videos up in my hometown, but I mean, we'll, we'll get some things figured out to, uh, to show. I mean, it'll be cold in Indiana. It's November back in Indiana. I'm going to freeze. But it could be worse. But I'm about to, uh, about to pull up to this gym. Get some, some workout in. And I will catch you guys probably back in the van after the gym. Man, terrible drivers in the state, dude. Real quick before I close out, if any of you guys from Arizona... Uh, you know what I'm talking about? Like, when I first moved here, I literally had to, like when I first drove around the interstate for the first time, I had to get out of my van and I checked my turn signals when I got home to see if uh, see if they're still working. Like, nobody lets you in, everybody cuts you off. It's absolutely horrible here. But uh, yeah, I'm gonna get off here and get a workout in. Catch you guys later. So, it's gonna work out. I got all my cash transferred over to money order. Came out to be 2700 and the chick recounted my money three times. So I'm running late to work right now. I have five minutes to be at work in a meeting. So I'm at the park in the pay parking lot and change still. So I'm gonna be a little late. So hopefully they don't start right at 345. We'll see. But uh, working tonight up till uh, up till uh, 9 o'clock and then, like I said I open tomorrow so it should be a busy couple days I'm trying to think of the fastest way to get there dude so frustrated I didn't want to say anything though I didn't want to be rude but she was taking so long it's like she couldn't recount but this right here will pay off my credit card debt and pay back some money I owe people. Actually, I don't owe anybody any money, really. It's just frustrating that it took so long. I'm not going to be able to eat at all unless I order at work. This, these are first world problems. The lady took too long to count my $2,700. Late to work at a bartending job on Mill Avenue, one of the busiest college campuses in the U.S for me, right? But, uh, I'm gonna try and gather as much of my stuff as I can possible right now get into work. So I'll catch you guys later.